Hi, my beautiful Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. See David. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much to all my Capricorn that have been supporting my channel. I'm grateful and thankful, and I'm sending lots of love, blessing, and prosperity your way. This is a general love reading. It won't resonate with everyone. If this reading is not resonate with you, please check out your other birth chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonates and leave the rest. Thank you so much to all of you that have been supporting my channel. Thank you for the love. Thank you so, so, so much. I am so grateful for all your support, for, for your like, your subscribe, your sharing those videos. I appreciate you guys so much. This is a general love reading. It won't resonate with everyone. If this reading is not resonate with you, check out your other birth chart placement for more clarity. Take what resonate and leave the rest. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter for my lovely copies. Thank you, God. Thank you, Universe. Ancestor, Spirit, Guy, Archangel, Ascended Master, the Pure White Light. Please guide it, guide it this reading and give my lovely Capricorn a clear, precise, honest message. And thank you so much for guiding me and protect me, protect my household throughout this whole reading. Thank you so much. And so it is. All right. Universe, what is the message you have for my Capricorn? What is the message? Oh, okay. No vitality, no beginning. So there's a no beginning. Wow. Okay. So there could be a fire sign that coming for you. You have some no beginning here with some creative endeavors, some creative project could be also be a uh, no relationship. But I felt like a lot of creation here, a lot of creativity here. Wow. No beginning. What is the message you have for my Capricorn? 11. <laughs> you have one, no vitality. You also have the magician. Again, another one, which is 11. That means something to you guys. Look up number 11 to what it's meant for you. So you have no beginnings for you. And you also have Seko Chakra. So whatever this is for you, this is something you manifest. So you guys might be dealing with an air sign or Virgo. I feel like there's some type of communication you guys need to have here regarding business, regarding some type of partnering, getting together. And also there is a sexual connection here for you guys with the Seko Chakra. A lot of creativity and this whole process is like, I feel like you guys manifesting this. You manifest something brand new and you are going to get what you are manifesting with the sickle chakra with the sickle chakra is also a lot of creativity a lot of creative endeavors business partnering and also um sexual energy sexual desire here with the sickle chakra so beautiful energy beginning a new beginning and some type of uh, sexual connection whatever this connection you guys are going to have there's a lot of sexiness a lot of passion a lot of uh like i say you guys could be dealing with a fire sign virgo uh virgo gemini energy here beautiful oh look at that the lovers okay love is in the brain love is in the brain so again partnering but i feel like there's a decision with partnering here there's a decision you guys need to make here uh to partnering with someone decision 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 you have choice so to to uh, make it when it's come to all lovers here that's what i'm saying you guys could have some type of uh very close connection where you guys feel each other's energy sexually let's see what's this person feeling towards my lovely capricorn let's see what's this person feeling towards towards capricorn five of cups okay some type of regrets here, some type 
of don't want to give anymore this person come this person come as a page what they feel about you and stuff like that this person feel like you could wave your magic wand and make things happen which is you can because you come in as the magician so this person feel like you can make whatever you want happen or you know what you want is a new beginning and stuff like that because they come as a page a page very curious very i told you very curious someone is very desiring they they want to get what they, they want what they want and they want it now because they they're very um uh, sexual active that's what i'm feeling with the page of ones here because i feel like this person felt like they're tired of giving they felt like all the energy they put out they're not giving they're not receiving the same the same way it's like putting the you know wasting their time that's what i'm feeling here with the five of cups they felt they're tired of giving the energies and then they go down the drains eight of pentacles but this is someone that want to put they want to put the work on this they want when when i mean they want to put the work on it they want to put the work on it but i feel like you guys more want to focus on your on your project your your capricorn of course you want to focus on manifesting brand new beginning you want to focus on what you want and, you know i feel like you guys are savage here but whomever you are dealing with they want to put work on this so what they how they feel about you is that you know they've been rejected before they've been left out in the cold before this person is they're sitting here with one cups they're willing to give they still want to give they still want to give some love they still want to receive love but they're just tired of giving they're still they're tired of giving that's what they they would page of ones the eight of pentacles they want to put the work they want to you know do the deed with you <laughs> let's see. we have nine of swords this person worried they're feeling in despair they're feeling sad disappointed the knight of pentacles this person sees you as single and what they want is that they want um they want some type of commitment some type of contract this this like i say the, you got the high offend here could be dealing with the toys Virgo Capricorn you want someone more stable you want someone more stable someone who's gonna give you you know you want I feel like some type of friends but whomever you are dealing with they definitely worry they'll have a lot of sleepless night a lot of regret and uh remorse and despair and despair so there could be some type of contract you try to work some type of contract there could be a work oh okay <laughs> look what the card dragons the devil <laughs> you could feel like this person is toxic or this person feel like you toxic but this is you copy ah king of cups and the ten of cups so we have the king of cups ten of cups wish and dream ultimate contentment the happiness look at that king of cups ten of cups ten of wands they dragged me down to see this right here and then the tower boom someone out of the blue is gonna left the mix is someone out in the mix is gonna left because i feel like the king of cups and the devil is you it's you coming as the reading as very loving very caring very passionate you know you want you want the, you want some type of commitment here blissful co commitment contentment where well, with family you want some type of family you want some type of family here the high offend here some type of commitment you want to offer someone a commitment here but i feel like this person is in their head you want some brand new beginning because there was an ending that's coming for you so you can have this brand new beginning let's clarify the knight of swords why is this person is in their head because they felt rejected look at that again five of cups 
This person is in deep regret, deep remorse here because they feel, they feel rejected here. Give me one more card for the Nine of Swords. You are their wish fulfillment. This person sees you have multiple offer. They, this person felt like you could have multiple offer here. They felt like you could, you know, you got your wish and your dream and stuff. They feel, they feel reje rejected. They have living in a lot of regret and remorse by, you know, some type of, you know, doesn't have to be you that rejected them or do why they feel the way they do, but they are in a lot of regret here and crying over spilled milk and stuff, crying over spilled whatever, because they got a lot of regrets here. Clifford the Highway, friend. Clifford the Highway, friend. The wall. And then some type of, there's an ending of a contract. There's something that's going to end. There's a lesson that learned here. For you guys could be in a high high standard. You guys could raise the bar really high. You want someone with high standard, with high morals value here. So you ending something. Could be dealing with any of the um of the fixed sign here. Why is the wall here? Why is the wall here? Six of Pentacles, patiently waiting for something to grow for someone. Look at that. Five of Swords. What I'm feeling here with this Five of Swords is just someone is really not showing who they are. Someone you waiting for something to end here. They're really not showing. This person felt like they are victory. And at the same time, there was no victory here. Because I feel like if you're dealing with the Taurus, there's a lesson for this person to learn. This is someone that might be a bit dramatic. They might be a bit dramatic here, but they're waiting for something to end. Lesson, some lesson learned here with this uh, Five of Swords. Clarify the Knight of Pentacles. Yeah, someone fell left out and there's another five. You know, you could be dealing with someone. Five of cups, five of pentacles, five of swords. Five, five, five. Major transformation, major change for you here, uh, copy. Major change. Someone fell left out in the cold. They are single now. They are single and free. You, like I said, you could be dealing with a tourist that, feel, that fell left out in the cold by you. I fell in the like, and they're asking for some type of karma here. Someone is asking for justice, to get justice in the situation because they fell left out in the cold by you. Whether you left out in the cold by them or they left out in the cold, but someone in here is asking for some type of justice. I don't feel like this is you guys that's asking for justice. I feel like it's the person you are dealing with. They want they want something to make fair and right and just. That's what they're asking for justice here because they felt left out. They felt like they're giving so much to the relationship. They didn't get it the same in return. So they're asking for, they are in, uh, having some type of instability here with the five of swords and stuff like that. I feel like so this person might be very much envious. Let me see what they're envious about. Clarify the five of swords. They could be envious of your energy. They could be envious of your whatever you have. Someone in here is envious of that with the Seven of Swords defensive because you put a defense mechanism. You're not giving your energy and time to this person. So they feel like some type of, um, you know, jealousy and things like that and envious here. Why this person is asking for justice? Why is this person is asking for justice? Nine of Swords. They want some type of truth to speak. They want, they want you to speak some type of truth here. There's some truth. They want to know something. This person wants to know some things. And all you guys, also you guys could be dealing with the, the justice system. If you guys go dealing with the justice system, things is going to work just fine for you. You're going to get... You're going to get justice in this situation. Clarify the Five of Cups. 
yeah you guys might be dealing with you know there's like some type of marriage some type of relationship that's coming to end the queen of swords you guys might be dealing with the justice system now someone is standing in the power so if you're dealing with this queen of swords they're standing in the power they want nothing but the truth they don't want nothing unless you're gonna come to them with the truth they don't want to hear it the king of cups they see you as loving though they see you still love them. This person know you still love them. You come in as the king of cups. We have the king of cups over here also. They see you as very loving, caring. Could be dealing with an air sign, which is Libra. Or, um, yeah, they see you as very loving, caring, and compassionate and everything. But at the same time, they want some type of justice. They want you to speak the truth to them because they see you as wish fulfillment. But they have a lot of regret and remorse. I, know, I don't know why they have regret and remorse. Clarify the page of wands. Give me one card. Two of wands. They're ready to move. They're ready to move on, to move forward here. Give me one more card for the two of wands. Queen of wands in the reverse. You release the queen of wands. You release you release a fire sign. You could be released a fire sign here, a Leo to be specific. So you release someone here because you want balance. You let go of this person because you want you want balance in your life. And you want the queen of swords. But the queen of swords standing in the power with the truth here. Yeah, you, whomever you are dealing with, they are, you could be dealing with an air sign that has a lot of regret and remorse. Because something coming into an end. Some, they're learning some karma here. Someone could be getting some karma and they want it. You want a new beginning because you want something brand new, period. You're like, I don't mind be friends with benefits, but... That's all is going to be. Yeah, the magician is at the bottom again. So we're going to leave the card right there. I'm not going to uh, pull no more cards because we have the magician. That's your first card. So which is another one, which is make it um, 111 here. We have the magician, which is comfort, double confirmation that you want something brand new. You manifest something brand new. You don't want to deal with this person. You have other options. So you can be with anyone you want to. But what you chose is to release this. You release the Queen of Wands so you can be with the Queen of Swords. You ended a relationship with someone. Passion. A magnetic and seductive quality surround you at present at present enjoy it at the present time would it be nice reflection give each other some space at the moment trust and have faith that all will work out for the best so yeah that's what i'm feeling here you got like you got someone that you are very passionate about when it's come to desiring intimate relationship and there's someone here you get you uh you release you let go of so you can have this passion okay all right copy that's all i have for you guys don't forget to subscribe like share i love you guys bye copy